uh, one senator stood in the way of this uh, compromise uh, and he got his way, didn't he? That's right. That's Joe Lieberman. It looks like he is probably not going to stand in the way of health care anymore. And that's because Democrats are bowing to his demands, not just to drop a public option, but also a compromise idea to allow people starting at age 55 to buy into Medicare. Now, Democrats are going to do that very likely because they need Lieberman's vote, vote. But it is making a lot of Democrats very angry towards him. So I asked him about that. I, I, don't in, I don't enjoy the personal uh, vendetta. Uh, I certainly don't enjoy people attacking my wife, which is outrageous. Uh, but, uh, you know, I've been at this a long time, and in the end, you, you, if you try to please everybody, you will do nothing. You talk to a lot of Democrats, and there, there is a fundamental feeling among many of them that you have animus towards the president, that you have animus towards your former party, and that they say that this is all about Joe Lieberman. Well, that's just poppycock. I mean, this is all about what I think health care reform should be. The president and I have a, a very good, mutually respectful relationship. Uh, if, if I had any sense of vendetta against the Democratic Party, I wouldn't be in the Democratic caucus. Dana, you asked uh, Senator Lieberman about the intense scrutiny that he is now under. What did he say? Uh, well, he said he's certainly not happy about it. He's not happy that his wife is being attacked. But you know, he obviously is an independent officially. He caucuses with the Democrats. But I asked about his next election for Senate, about 2012, and whether he'd consider running as a Republican. Any <clears throat> chance Joe Lieberman would run as a Republican? I, I don't know what I'll run as. Um, I, I like being an independent. Um, so that's definitely a possibility. But I, I'd say that uh, all options are open. Really? Yeah. It's unlikely that I would run as a Republican, but I wouldn't uh, foreclose any possibility. He went on to say it's more likely I'd run as an independent, but it depends where I am. i got to tell you, Wolf, the Democrats, not not just the liberal blogs, but the Democrats we talk to around here who work with him every day, who are already upset with him, when they say, see that he is even raising the possibility of running as a Republican, they're not going to be very happy. Yeah, that's going to further irritate uh, them. You got it. But they need him. Without him, there's no deal, they right? They sure do. Yeah, they so need him. They need him. That's why he's chairman of an important committee. That's why they are bowing to him on this very important policy issue to get health care through. It looks like he's going to get his way, at least for now. All right, Dana, thank you.